Good morning, guys. Welcome to a new vlog. Today is Tuesday and it's also not morning. It's 1.30 in the afternoon. I'm just used to saying good morning in my vlogs. So I, right now, I'm sitting in my car. I just got my lashes done. Aren't they so pretty? I haven't got my lashes done in like two, maybe three months. I like to take breaks frequently when I don't like get them just to give my lashes a rest. But we have a wedding this weekend, so I'm getting all my beauty errands done this week. This vlog, I predict, is going to be a beauty slash self-care vlog, and I think I'm gonna vlog the whole entire week. Oh my god, why is there fluffs everywhere? My sweater is like shedding crazy. Um, anyway, yeah, we have a wedding this weekend, so I'm getting all my beauty errands done. Got my lashes done today, I got my eyebrows done yesterday. So this situation is set. I need to get my nails done probably tomorrow. I actually need to call right now and make my nail appointment. I need to get nails and a pedicure. And then I'm actually getting my hair done, which I'm not doing just for the wedding. I'm actually like, I need to get my hair done desperately. I haven't gotten it colored in probably six weeks. No, six months. <laughs> and I'm just going to get the same I always do. I get foliage and I usually get like blonde. I was thinking about going darker because my hair is really damaged and I just need it to rest but I just can't let go of the blonde just yet. So yeah, we're gonna go Thursday to get my hair done. That's gonna be a day long event. It's always, it always takes like eight to nine hours for me to do my hair. So yeah, I figured I'll vlog all that this week and it's just gonna be another work week for me. I have some videos I need to record. I'm recording a Sephora sale video because the Sephora sale's coming up, I feel like holiday sale. So I'm excited to buy stuff for that and to go film that video. I'm actually gonna go to Sephora today I think probably right now. I'm gonna go get a coffee because I haven't had coffee yet. It's 1.30. I never drink coffee before I get my lashes done because like my eyes will be like fluttering like crazy and you have to keep them shut the whole time. So I think we'll do coffee now. Starbucks probably. And then um, I'll stop by Sephora to see what's new and to make kind of like my shopping list um, and just kind of prep before I film that video. And then I also have to film a try on haul with Princess Polly. These fluffs are everywhere. I don't know if the, ca the camera probably isn't picking it up, but there's little like fluff balls everywhere. Oh my God. Okay, anyway, so that's the plan for today. I'm gonna get going. It's raining today. Ugh, I hate the rain. It rains every day now. Like I thought rain is supposed to be in spring and summer. Why is it still raining in November? It's literally November 1st. It's so cold already. And it went from like 80 degrees to 40 degrees overnight. I'm not lying. Maryland weather, I'm tired of it. I'm sick of Maryland weather. But anyway, it'll be a nice productive week. And I hope you guys are all having a nice week as well. Oh, by the way, um, lashes. I got my lashes done by my girl here in um, Rockville. If you guys are in Montgomery County, and you're in the DMV area, Rockville, that whole area, that's where I go. And I do have a code um, if you guys wanna check her out, if you guys wanna go to her. It's Stephanie Rose 15 you can get 15% off. So yes, use my code if you wanna get your lashes done. Why I decided to wear my brand new ultra mini Uggs in the rain, I do not know. Oh my God, I can never get over how Amazing drinking a chai latte feels a hot one because all summer I was drinking the cold iced ones But finally It is finally like holiday season. It just reminds me of like the holidays. It tastes like it tastes like Christmas time I can't wait for them to bring back the Peppermint mocha. That's my favorite Christmas drink. All right, so I picked up a coffee for myself. I got one for Ancho too I got him a little Little tiny caramel macchiato. I just realized for is a very 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 far walk from the parking lot and there's no overhead I don't have a jacket and I'm not trying to get my Ugg boots <laughs> wet, even more wet than they are. So I'll come back, I'll probably come back tomorrow after I get my nails done. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna work. I need to get, I need to like do so much stuff. Sometimes when I'm out, I like look at my emails just to see what like I'm missing. And when I get so, so many emails and people asking me for things, I get so much anxiety and this stems back to when I used to work my nine to five, back when I worked at 
my last job was super micromanagey, very, very toxic. Like these people were harassing you every single minute for something. So like, I feel like I'm so scarred from that. Like a little bit of toxic work environment, PTSD. So even though I work for myself, I have no boss. I literally am my own boss. Sometimes it doesn't feel like it. Sometimes it feels like uh, the brands that I work with, like sometimes it feels like they are the ones that like are in control but like i keep forgetting like as a content creator like the content creator is the one that like you know has got it but it just stems back to my trauma that i faced uh, that, that's dramatic but it honestly was so traumatic crying every day that's pretty traumatic so yeah we gotta go home and do some work i gotta answer emails i'm gonna film some stuff and then i maybe i'll come back to Sephora later today because i actually want to make tacos for dinner tonight because it's tuesday taco tuesday i need to get lettuce um and i think i need to get taco shells oh look how gorgeous the trees are oh i'm so obsessed with fall trees hey guys it's a few hours later i worked for the majority of the day when i got back and i quickly ran to target just to pick up some ingredients i needed for taco tuesday yes yeah, so we're making tacos i'm making ground turkey tacos and i had to pick up some lettuce for the tacos, I always make black beans with the with the tacos, so I picked some up, and then I got some shells, and I got some sauce from the Good and Gather line. It's lime crema sauce, so that looked really good. It said great for adding extra flavor to tacos, rice bowls, and salads. So, yes, yeah, so we just got those, and then I have onions, tomatoes, and all the other stuff. I have the meat, so I'm just gonna cook the meat really quick chop up the veggies and put the shells in the oven. So excited, it's gonna be so good. vegetables are all cut up got my lettuce avocado onion tomato and lime and we also have some hot sauce and the lime crema sauce and I have the shells right now they're in the oven cooking and we got the turkey cooking I use the good and gather taco seasoning it has 35% less salt sodium than other seasonings and we got the black beans which I think are done so I will turn that off. All right, y'all, here are the tacos. They look so good. I like filled it to the brim, to the top, but everything's in there. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to eat. Hi you guys, it is the next day. I just got my nails done. The lighting is really bright, sorry, but let me show you. Or I'll probably do an up close. I'll do an up close of um, my nails, but I just got my nails done and a pedicure. I got black tips. I feel like they blend in with my sweatshirt from far away because they're literally black. And I got black on my toes as well, black uh, gel pedicure. So we are all blacked out for the fall, literally, even my whole outfit is all black. So that took like two and a half hours. Um, every time I get my nails and pedicure at the same time, it always takes so long. But anyway, I got that out of the way. We also got my lashes and eyebrows the other day. So tomorrow I'm gonna get my hair done. 
so that's gonna take all day my hair is really thick and long and it takes all all day long to dye it so I'm trying to like get everything done today today's Wednesday um, so right now I'm gonna go to Sephora and I need to pick up a bronzer and also I want to just shop around and plan out what I want to buy for the Sephora sale and then I'm gonna go home I have to edit a video and um, post some content plenty of emails yeah we got a lot of work to do today so it is currently 12 o'clock I went to the nail salon right when they opened at nine so I was literally there for three hours almost actually so yeah now that that's out of the way I can go do the rest of my errands and have a productive hump day happy hump day oh I forgot to show you an up close to my nails I'll do that when we when I park at my next destination but if you guys can kind of see and the lady who did my nails she was so so sweet she did my pedicure also she was like a little old lady not old sorry she was like maybe in her 50s but I'm so used to having like younger people do my nails and she was so sweet and there was like a time when I had to use my phone I got like an email that was like really important and I like had to email back on my phone and she gave me like a little pen um, like a touchpad pen to touch my phone with and she also had I don't know if this is common but I've never had this in nail salons before she had little like they look like little stools but for your wrist so you can like rest your wrist on this little like platformed I don't know what you call it but it's like a is like an armrest so that was so sweet it's just like the little touches like that so I tipped her really well and she was actually so happy I feel like she wasn't used to getting tipped that well because I gave her the tip and like literally maybe a couple seconds later as I was walking out she like yelled back she's like enjoy your nails bye thank you like being so nice oh my god that was like the best nail experience I've ever had and I always get a lot of questions about where I get my nails done I get them done at inspire nail bar that's in Rockville Maryland in the DMV so I recommend them oh my god I didn't get her name <gasps> why didn't I ask oh shoot I always forget to get people's names that do my like nails because she was the, a new person I went to but she was like the cutest I think she's actually brand new because I've been going here for a while and I've never seen her before oh darn it I'm so upset how do I like ask for I don't want to just be like what's the name of the older lady I feel like that's rude but anyway yeah but they're all good there everyone that I go to is is really good all right so here's an up close of the nails I got almond shape and I asked for black French tips I've been wanting to get black French tips like all fall and all season so I'm glad I finally did I love it I'm having the most random breakfast. I made a couple of hard boiled eggs. I've actually been really into making hard boiled eggs every day for breakfast now. I have some little tomatoes, turkey bacon, and that's a cauliflower thin from Trader Joe's. I'll probably put my egg on it and just um, eat it like that. And I'm editing my video and I'm also drinking my Bellway fiber drink that I always talk about. I'm trying to de bloat this week, so that's kind of also why I'm eating a little bit more lighter than I usually do. So yeah, we're in the process of detoxing and that's also why Bellway is good is because it helps with the detoxing and the um, de-bloating and all that. It's a few hours later. I finished working and it is now 5 508. I don't know why I just did that like the Sun is blocking my face I'm getting ready to go meet up with my friend for happy hour So we are meeting up nearby and we're gonna get some drinks eat some dinner I haven't eaten since that breakfast actually and I'm pretty hungry So we're gonna get some food get some drinks and this is what I'm wearing I did a little sleek back low ponytail and I have on my trench coat from Misguided that I showed in my fall try on haul this year. I have on my White Fox Boutique cowl neck or turtleneck sweater and my jeans from Loft that I'm so obsessed with. I, again, I showed this in one of my recent videos. I think everything I'm wearing I actually showed in a previous video, but I can link this whole outfit. And then my little pillow puffy purse from H&M and my Doc Martens. This is my first time wearing my Docs this fall season. I haven't worn these since last winter, so 
we broke them out this year and went for like a casual cool outfit. Hey guys, welcome to the next day. Oh my god, my glasses are fogging up because I'm like sweating and it's freezing out. It's 40 degrees, but I was running to my car because I'm running a little late for my hair play that I'm about to go get my hair done. I don't know how much I'll get to vlog because this is my first time going to this girl. I've gone through so many stylists in the past three years um, because like they move or like I am, I don't like their service, like how they did. The reason I'm going to somebody new this time is because the last person I went to prices are so, so expensive. Hey guys! Oh my god, I'm so excited right now. Ah! I'm blonde again! Yes, hey guys. Wow, it looks so much better in natural lighting. So I just got out of the salon. It is 4.40 p.m. I got here at 10 a.m. So what is that about? six hours that's not bad that's actually so much better than the last time i went to get my hair done i was literally in the salon last time for nine hours till like eight o'clock at night oh my god i'm so happy with that service she did such an, an amazing job she was super nice such a comfortable experience if you guys are in the dmv and you uh want to know where i went you can shoot me a dm or leave a comment i can let you guys know um where i went but oh I'm so obsessed. So I basically just got foliage and basically she just did teasing. She teased the hair, did full head of foils and we just did a bleach out and toner and that's pretty much it. And it looks so, so good. But it the color will get lighter because right now it's super ashy because of the toner. It's just like all toner. Um, so eventually like, after I shampoo it a few times the color will come out not come out It will just appear more like it'll be more blonde and more bright because right now it's like super cool and and um, just very ashy Oh my god, I feel like a brand new person. Like do you ever just like feel like so Rejuvenated when you get your hair done. I have my lashes on my nails and I have not been this put together in so long So happy. All right, so I need to go home now so i'm actually so shocked that it's only 4 40. i was expecting to be done by like six and have my whole day gone but i'm gonna go home i have like i feel like so happy like i have the whole day ahead of me basically it's only 4 40 whatever i need to go home i need to do my laundry we need to clean i also want to film i'm so obsessed i can't stop looking at myself in the rearview mirror ah! you need to be obsessed with your hair guys go to someone who makes your hair obsessed with you. Go to someone who makes you obsessed with your hair. That's what I meant to say. Okay guys, I'll check with you guys later. Hello guys, I'm back home. So, change of plans. When I got my hair done, my mom called me and asked me to go eat dinner with her and my dad. We went to a Mexican place. It was really good, like so, so good. So yeah, I had dinner with them. I don't need to make dinner, so that's nice. So I'm home now. I need to do some laundry. I just got a package from Aritzia in the mail I wanted to show you guys because I'm wearing the absolute comfiest sweatshirt and sweatpants right now. I got this sweatshirt and these matching sweatpants. I love the color of them. It is Heather Cloud White and it's so, so, so soft. This is my first time getting a sweatshirt from them. I've gotten sweatpants from them before and I really like the quality. These are so incredibly comfortable like the quality is amazing obviously but for some reason i thought because it's a ritzy i thought it would be like really stiff but it's really not at all it's so so comfortable i really want to buy more colors now but yeah i got this in the mail today i got these sweatpants i'll link these in the description oh and i also got a puffer i really love this puffer this is a vegan leather puffer it's kind of cropped here's what this looks like yeah it's a little bit cropped but it's like not too bad. So cute. This is even a cute outfit just like this. So yeah, I'll link the jacket in the description if you want to check it out. Oh, I also got this mask. <laughs> I got a mask because I am starting to lose all my masks and I just wanted to pick up another every day when I really like the color of this. It's like a neutral. So yeah, love all these. I'll link everything in my description, Aritzia.
happy Friday. I'm gonna put this down on here. I might need a bigger tripod. This is gonna be my tripod for today. Or all of paper towels. So yes, today is Friday. I am currently sipping on coffee. I can't remember if I mentioned in a recent vlog or this week that I started using almond creamer in my coffee because I bought soy creamer last week and I showed you guys in a couple videos I was using soy creamer for my coffee and a lot of you guys told me that was was not good. I wasn't aware of how that wasn't uh, good for females especially so I googled it, I researched it and yeah I tossed it in the trash so thank you guys for that helpful tip. So yeah I love almond creamer, it just tastes so good. So today is kind of a chill work day and I just posted a Princess Polly try on haul so that's up now. I got so many cute clothes for the fall, blazers, coats and dresses super cute stuff so go check that video out if you haven't seen it yet we're going to a dress rehearsal dinner today tonight for a wedding that we're going to be in tomorrow so i'm probably going to stop vlogging today so i can like kind of just like chill for the weekend i don't plan on working this weekend because we're going to be at a wedding i'm going to be busy i'm in the wedding so um i just kind of want to chill hang out it's going to be anto's like whole family so we're going to just hang out with family and friends and It'll be nice and relaxing. And Sunday, I literally need like a mental break, like day off, because this weekend was so busy. Oh, I just got a package in the mail. I just opened it right before I started vlogging. It's from Nasty Gal. I got some, I only got a few things. I got like three things, but I wanted to show you guys because I love Nasty Gal. And the pieces that I got are so cute. So I want to show you guys really quick what I got. The first thing I got from Nasty Gal is, are we surprised, a sweatshirt. And this is from their collab. I think it was like a collab or a line. It was something with Sports Illustrated because they have so many different loungewear and just a bunch of clothes with Sports Illustrated on it. So this says, I think, Essentials established 1954. So I think this actually was in collaboration with Sports Illustrated. So I really like this one because I like the color of it. And I honestly think it matches the Aritzia sweatpants. I'm wearing the same sweatpants from yesterday. I feel like it's the same color. So yeah, I think this looks cute together, but I got this just to lounge in, maybe take some photos in, I don't know. Um, but I just really like the font of this, and it's on black, black and um, this like heather gray color, which is like my favorite color combo right now. So this is pretty comfortable, it's so soft, honestly, like this is like similar quality to the Aritzia sweatshirt that I got yesterday. Like I feel like it's the same material, oh my god, I should compare and see if like the detailings are the same, but like the inside feels just as soft and comfortable and really cozy as the Aritzia one so yeah we got this one this is the first thing I got and the last two things I got I only got three things um, from Nasty Gal but I got this cropped blazer I thought it was so pretty because of the color it's like a sage green color I feel like the lighting is like not showing it really well but it's so pretty it's kind of like a metallic feel to it um, like I said like it's kind of hard to pick up but it looks metallic to me and it has these drawstrings on the sleeves. So I love this. I think it's so chic. And then I also got these jeans, which I literally am obsessed with. These are the cutest jeans I've ever had. And I've never had jeans that like tie at the ankle like that. They look so cute with like anything, boots or heels. I think it's such a cute and unique style. Very, very trendy, very cute. So. I will link all these things in my description. Oh, by the way, I got these in a size 10. They're kind of loose, but um, I prefer it that way because I like my jeans loose. Normally, I'm a size 8, but I size up to 10, and they fit amazing. This, I believe, is a size large. I'm just size large and 8 and everything, just for reference. So, yeah, I'll link all these things in my description. Hi, guys. It's a few hours later. I just filmed a video. All my lights are set up. I filmed the Sephora sale video. So that video is going up probably next week, maybe in a few days, because the sale actually started today. Today's the fifth. So it started for Rouge members. So yeah, I just picked up some stuff and filmed the video. So I'm really excited about the sale this year. It's really good. So if it's up now, go check it out. If it's not, it'll be up in a few days. So we're gonna head out to the dress rehearsal dinner. We have to go meet up with Anto's family and all that. So I'm gonna actually end the vlog here since we're going to probably be busy the rest of the weekend with all the wedding stuff. So hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next one.